Hello everyone, I am Dr. Mayu Khajra and today I am going to discuss about a very unique topic that is how to crack NEET PG exam without any sort of coaching. Now this, is it really possible? This seems to be unreal, okay? Uh, yes, it indeed is possible. Like our mindset is made that uh, we see so many interviews Everyone has taken multiple coaching institutes, so this exam is uncrackable without coaching institute. But indeed, it is possible if you have your basics right. That is the basic subjects if you have right. Now, I always tell that there are three pillars in case of NEET PG exam. First is the notes for reading, understanding the concepts and multiple times of revision. This is the primary source of your studying. Now, MCQ solving. For assessment and practice means practicing of the MCQs is very much important. So you should practice approximately 50 to 100 MCQs daily. You will get a hang of solving MCQs and you will love to solve MCQs more and more. And number third pillar that is the grand test so that you analyze where you are standing in the real competition because in the NEET PG, your rank only decides which kind of branch in which college you are going to get. So you need to analyze where you are standing and improve accordingly. First coming to the notes. Okay, now notes are available in Telegram channel. As you know that uh, many Telegram channels, you can get any sort of notes or go to a book market like in Kolkata, there is College Street. You can get any sorts of notes. Even the marked BTR, annotated BTR also. Some channels you would get, uh, some contacts you would get, those who provide the annotated BTRs also. Okay, so you can get it easily in the internet or in if you want the hard copy, you can get in the book market. Now, another better source or a good source if you are trying to study is the USMLE Step 1 book. And if you combine it with BTR for the short subjects and the subjects that are lacking, that is the mainly the gynae, the community medicine, some parts, the short subjects, then it is a good source, I would say. You have got the notes. Now, if you read the study material, you can have some sort of confusion because you have not watched the video lectures of the coaching institute. So you are definitely gonna have some kind of difficulty in understanding the topic then you can google it as simple as that or watch a youtube video that discusses the concept or consult with anyone be it your friend who is having that particular app or uh, has that particular notes and studying or you can go and consult it with your faculties or anyone any senior you can consult okay so by this if you are having any doubt in any concept, it would be clarified. Coming to the MCQs. Now, from where you can get free MCQs without coaching. So, pre-PG app is there that has some free MCQs. But uh, if you want to assess everything, then you have to pay for it. And PYQs you can get in the Neat Essence book. Okay, In the Neat Essence book, you can get the PYQs. And I will be providing after this video the PYQs of those who have clicked the join button and join my YouTube channel. And why the PYQ solving is important? Let me make you crystal clear by an example that if you are going to play in a cricket field, means you see the matches, at first they analyze the pitch. The commentators tell that this pitch is going to help the swing or it is going to help the spin. So you need to assess the pitch before batting. Like you see that uh, first the batsmen play defensive. After they understand the pitch, they play offensive. So to play offensive and to score better, you need to understand what kind of important topics Need PG is focusing on. And this would help you understand the pitch of Need PG. So to understand pitch of Need PG, you should solve the MCQs. Now coming to the grand test, as I told beforehand only, it assesses your position in the real game. So it is a real match, like solving MCQs. If solving MCQs is a practice match or a net practice on the real pitch you are going to play, then 
giving a GT or a CBT is playing the real match against real opponents. Okay, so this much difference is between MCQ solving and GT giving. Okay, so GT is a must, and always give the GTs in a personal computer. And CBTs are a must, I would say. Many YouTubers don't speak about CBTs, but that gives a real time exam hall experience, and you have no source. And uh, the exam hall experience is unmatched with that of giving in home, in your comfort zone, the problems that you are going to face in the exam hall that would be reflected in a CBT, but not in a GT. So giving GTs is a must and analyzing the GTs and CBTs is equally very important so that you know the your weak topics and how you can improve. So if you are willing to improve your GT score and how to analyze the GT if you want to know then you can go and watch my one of the top videos that I am providing in the i button. Okay go and watch the video now only. Now coming to the fourth point and it is a very important point is guidance because you are not taking any coaching so you are not getting the guidance of the faculties like how to study what to study and all so you can get the guidance following any seniors okay any recent seniors those who have cracked the neat pg exam not the seniors those who are preparing have not cracked i like i started making the videos after i cracked neat pg because once who has cracked he only can guide you the best okay because if anyone has qualified the certain exam he can guide you the best rather than uh, faculties who have cracked many years before so a recent senior who has cracked the neat pg exam he would be the best guide because he knows the recent patterns the recent trends of asking questions and he has faced the recent high competition also so you can follow it by any of your college senior if you have any college senior who has cracked the neat pg exam with an excellent rank follow his advice or you can follow in the youtube also there are many youtubers if you like my content do subscribe and social support you can follow my advice now importance of coaching see i can't tell that co coaching is simply bogus and without coaching you can do much better than with coaching so it is a personal choice uh, some people have some financial constraint uh, or may have some issues with coaching that they are teaching very much fast and it is not very much beneficial for me. So personal issues, if it is present, then opt for no coaching. But there is an importance of coaching. Like if I want to go from Kolkata to Delhi, there are two routes. That is, I can go via multiple trains. I am not talking about the direct trains like the Purba or Rajdhani means multiple changing trains I can go by that and another one is that I can go comfortably by a flight so the flight is the coaching and the multiple trains is without coaching so changing multiple trains you would have a bit of hackle and you would have a loss of time it would consume a bit of time more time and less comfort but it would save much of your money and flight it would give the comfort it can reach you to your destination on time but it would cost high so that is the difference i think uh, that is a similar analogy i can take with coaching and non coaching i hope this video was helpful and if you like the video then show some like and share it with your friends and stay tuned for the next video.